these are the elevators here at the Hilton uh, San Jose this is the airport and only location here so let's go ahead and call one up they are Montgomery modernized by Kone you can tell by the blue indicator up there that they are indeed uh, Montgomery's oh this one's jumped lantern so we'll go ahead and go up Hi, what floor? Uh, number right. Hey. Thank you. Uh -huh. There you go. Thanks, man. Uh -huh. All right. Very tall cab. Very nice. One of them, uh, it might be this one, I forget. Makes a really thunderous stop at uh, Lobby. Mm. Excuse me. Watch the button go out and the door is open. Actually, I don't think I've ridden this one yet. This is my first ride on this one. There are three in the bank. As you can see, we're here on the top floor. The middle one actually has the Epco trick where uh, it'll, or it was, the gong was installed wrong. That's where the lobby just went out. And back, weird, like that. There's something wrong with that light. The light in the uh, lobby button. So we get to watch it go out multiple times. Hooray. So I'll switch up at 18. Indicator. Very nice. Typically, uh, I believe it's either the top three or the top two floors which would either be 16, 17, and 18, or just 17 and 18 are uh, supposed to be locked off. All right, going up? Yep. Uh, what floor? 12, please. 12. Uh, oh, there it is. switch at 18 and I'll also switch batteries because this one's dying getting low battery but typically on this camera with the extended batteries it'll stay for a little bit longer so we'll go ahead and once the button goes out select lobby and there's the executive lounge let that go and let me switch batteries okay guys sorry about that swapped batteries and we're about to swap the elevators. I'm hoping to get this one so I can show you guys the uh, triple F code chime. It's probably it's gonna be one of these two, I'm pretty sure. I don't know what's wrong. This one only takes twice. Alright, we're gonna send you back down the lobby. No. There's out. We'll get a few as that leaves. All right, good. Call up another one. Get a view out here. There's the Marriott. The uh, Discovery Museum, or Tech, tech Museum's all there. Oh, here's this one. Cabs look exactly the same, except when we start getting down to the lower or to lobby, I'll put the camera on the floor and do an impact cam because the leveling is uh, quite uh, 
Well, I'm not sure how to explain it. Innovation Universal. These were installed in 1992, and I believe, or if these were originally Montgomery, which I'm pretty sure they are, uh, like I said, these were installed in 1992. So, be, by the blue indicators in the lobby, I'm guessing these are Montgomery, and Montgomery Coney was 1994, it was when the companies merged. So these are definitely Montgomery's. Pretty cool. Modernized, as you can tell. Yeah, this is not one complete panel. This one's raised off, but probably has the uh, original or same fixtures. So here, if I can find my flashlight, hold on. We'll get a look at the shaft. Here you can see your inner lock door equipment up the shaft. You can see the whoa. Okay, that scared me. Oh, apparently I wanted to go somewhere. 17. Great. Let me select lobby. There we go. It just came to park. Going down? No, no. Well, before it starts nudging again. There's again, look up the shaft wiring. There's your clutch. Your door clutch. So we'll get over here in the corner and watch this. I just noticed a failure in the elevator. Check that out. These are traction, I'm pretty sure, overhead. And, uh,. Yeah, uh, no, these aren't hydraulic. That's actually for the parking garage elevator, which is a Westinghouse RT, I'm pretty sure. So we'll go ahead and get out here. And we'll let that close up. There's a lantern. Standard innovation lantern. Again, it looks like these were replaced since they are off the wall. And you can actually see into it. Pretty cool. There's the Monty Blue indicator. And that's it.